Yo, it's Sway. 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 In the morning. 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 Only on Shade 45. Wake your fuck ass up. Yeah, bitches. Tim Bathley is here. Yep. He has the new movie, Greetings from Tim Buckley. The film is um, releasing on May 3rd, Friday in New York and L.A. and also be available on VOD um, April 16th. Uh, congratulations. You got to continue. You got to keep working. Uh, but I have to take you back to Gossip Girl for a second. Just do it. Can I call you Dan? <laughs> uh, <laughs> Damn, <once>. Sway. <laughs> yeah, as you know, Penn plays uh, Dan Humphreys, who ended up, being coming the biggest villain of them all in that last season, man, you just went dark. Your Yo, character yeah. just passed the hell out. Yeah, I you went know? dark and neon pink. Yeah, this like, yeah. was just ridiculous. <laughs> and I, yeah. just as a, a watcher over the years, um, it, it to me, it, Dan Humphreys ended up being the Gossip Girl, mm -hmm. really. Yeah. Um, and I just had a sense that that decision wasn't made. Until the last minute, <laughs> the way it was. You know, well, here's the interesting thing about that is that Stephanie told me this uh, towards the end of the season. She said that in the beginning, um, that they had to recut the pilot episode because people thought I was Gossip Girl. And I went back and watched the pilot, and the first time you ever hear Gossip Girl sign off and say XOXO Gossip Girl, it's on me at the computer. So it's like there, there is some unintentional foreshadowing, okay. I think, which, okay. you know, in some ways I think works really well. But, you know, the truth is for Gossip Girl to be anyone real, it doesn't make it doesn't make actual sense. Yeah. You know, I mean, Dan Humphrey would have had to been like schizophrenic, bisexual, transgender, all sorts of, you know, obsessive compulsive because he's also checking his texts and, see. you know, like. Oh my God! I can't believe this. You know, so he's acting to everyone the whole that, time. That, that, yeah. yeah, you know, by himself even. That's so, so true, it's, man. It's, it's it's actually really deep if you think about it, mm. and it makes him a a, a a pretty pretty complex, torn up guy. Yeah, man, you played that shit on point, man. <laughs> Who are you in real life to be able to pull that off, man? Are you are you anything like that in real life? Uh, you got the beard thing, and you know. <laughs> I mean, you know, I wear dresses. Is that a big deal? No, 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 that's a big deal. <laughs> <laughs> no, who, who are like? Are are there any characters like? Are, is there Dan in you? Or? There's always a bit of your character in you. I mean, the thing about Dan is that like, there's all sorts of parts of him that are not me at all. But then, yeah, there there there, there are definitely parts of him. You know, I mean, I think. Uh, I don't know. It's weird, man. With TV, you always kind of you over over time. You've played the same character for so long. You really try to distance yourself from mm -hmm, them. Mm -hmm. But yeah, they do become you, and you because you're playing them. So they're just like. I mean, like I said before, I think more than anything, what's weird is that you start to forget, you know, it's like if you play them basically like yourself, yeah. but then you're doing something that you would never do. Mm -hmm. You're a little bit like, wait a second, I, I, I wouldn't do that, right? Right? But, yeah, but, no, 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 I wouldn't do that. Yeah, 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 yeah right? <laughs> but the, yeah, you get confused between the character and yourself. Definitely. Uh, yeah. yeah. Are the pressures different from television to film? Yep, your film comes out on Friday. It opens up against Iron Man, so to speak. Yeah, I mean, so it's gonna, it's gonna, it's gonna slay Iron Man. Yeah, no I'm doubt. Down. Oh, oh, yeah. no. <laughs> opening up in one theater, we're gonna yeah. kill. Oh no, man, you about to go <laughs> to the no, bank no. now? It, it, are, it, are the pressures different from television? You know, to film having to come out and do these mm. big numbers for box office versus coming out with that first when your or a TV show comes out, you have to do big numbers. What's yeah. the difference? I mean, yeah, there is a difference. I think it's, I think, uh, you know, I think the smartest thing to do for my sanity or anyone's in my position is just to not really put the pressure on yourself. Because, you know, I'm, it's not like I'm Tom Cruise or any, any, any names where it's like they're banking on that name. You mm -hmm. know? So, so I think, um, I mean, a film like this particularly, I just want people to see it, whether it's online or see, or see it in theaters. Because it's, you know, for, it's something that I'm proud of that, that I think is kind of a beautiful film. It's a, it's a weird kind of meditative, right. yeah. artistic adventure, you know, whereas television is, um, television is like, a, it's frothier, you know. It's just like it's fun and, it's, and you make however many hundreds of episodes. Mm -hmm. So it's just, it ends up becoming less precious. So, you know. It's just, yeah, there's just, there, you can't, in some ways, you really can't compare them even, you know? Well, well, greetings from Tim Buckley, man. You know, we're talking with Penn Badgley, man. And you, you, what, what is your ethnicity? Where are your people, where are your people from? You know, I'm a, I'm, 
truly American, and then I barely know. But I'm basically Irish. Irish, yeah, Irish Scottish, mostly. Dude, do do what I do, man. Do me a favor, but do it with your right leg. Put your put your leg up here like this, bro. If you don't mind, ready? All right. <laughs> you may be the hairiest person I ever met in my life. <laughs> Look at this dude's shins. <laughs> my That's gosh. Funny. You know, it's funny, though, man. Look at my arms. My it arms is, are, like, but bare. Arms are, when you put nair on your arms? No, like, dude. you don't shave your arms, no, but your shins no. are hairier than my right head. My hair, too, is nice. What? We got the chest I get, hair? I get a lot for the chest hair. Too. Really? Yeah, you should let Heather braid, French don't. braid your chest hair. <laughs> I'll put a bead on <laughs> it. You'll put a bead on it? Mm-hmm. Yeah, right, right. <laughs> <laughs> All right, man. Well, look, the movie is greetings from Tim Buckley, man. Pink, thanks for coming through. Yes. It's Sway in the Morning, only on Shea 45.